It is. And I ain't had all day. <laughs> I've been waiting on this. Hello, beautiful people, and welcome back to Shell's Closet. I have special guests again. Uh, while you're here, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. And y'all see I'm way back here with the little red button. Go ahead and hit that. To the right of that is a bell. You definitely want to hit so you know uh, anytime I post anything up on this channel. Right up there is a community tab. Go vote, 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 vote. vote. Vote for a song, any song you want to hear me sing this coming Saturday. Right there. For Saturday Night Live. Y'all already doing y'all thing. Um, you know, emotional roller coaster and uh, Eric Badu loving my life are tied right now. For yeah. Real? Hey. Yeah. What's good, y'all? But we got Mo here and we got Low Country. Seafood. It's so nice in the inside shell. Oh, it looked like like the streets. It looked like the. Sh it's like made like that country picnic. Um, you know, it's, it's it's dope in there. It's dope in the inside. They just got it here, so I figured, yeah. you know, why don't we just try it? on water, y'all from Milwaukee? Definitely go check them out. So oh my god, and it's still piping hot. We ordered this like an hour ago, literally. Uh, shell did. This is a lot. This is a lot of freaking food. There's a lot of food here. I'm gonna tell them what you got, shit. Okay, I got a uh, snow crab, shrimp, corn, sausage, potatoes. Oh, that sounds like a lot. That seems like a lot. But we about to eat. Oh, and we got for dessert. I can't show y'all because of my gloves. But we got beignet. Beignet, yeah. Beignet. I never had that. And today we're going to talk about love and relationships. Because my heartbreak anniversary is coming up. And I'm going to celebrate it because it's the first one since... <sighs> it's the first one since the ending. Man, listen. I've been heartbroken so many times. But we're going to get into that. Shell, are we going to pray? Of course. Okay. Wait, I think you should do it because it's your song and they don't know your song. Okay, well, we can say my prayer, you know. <laughs> God is good, God is great, and we thank him for this food. We're going to thank him in the morning, noon, and night. Because God, God, God is dynamite. Amen. Amen. Game. Y'all see, I be moving every time I'm praying. And shit, I meant to tell you, it's crazy. I was, what was I editing? I was editing our mukbang we did on my channel. If y'all have not already, go check it out. It's gonna be up. Go, go check It'll it out. It'll be up by the time it's up, hopefully. And Ross cousins. Session. Yeah, we did cousins mukbang, and Mimi was like, "Shell over there, uh, uh, getting every, it in." Every, and something, and then I noticed you wasn't moving no more. I'm like, "Come on, that's what my." That's, That's what it's about. Like, oh my God, it's a prayer. You know, a prayer is supposed to be still and not. Yeah, but we God know our heart. Yeah, we be lit. I'm going to go in for a shrimp. Oh I my God, we did the same thing. At the same time, I was praying that it wasn't no heads on these shrimp because. Yes. It got heads on them? That no. just be doing too much. Actually, I'm going to say my heart. I'm about to say this big old one before. Mm -hmm. Sure is. Let's uh, see what this about. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's all? I'm about to say it's got wheat. Oh, mine even hot. I know yours hot. I'm about to say it's got wheat. <clears throat> but I'm not. <clears throat> Ooh. King crab? <clears throat> what you want, a shrink, baby? <clears throat> Ooh. Ooh. Yep, that hit me pretty fast. What's the sauce? Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Want me to fill it? Yeah. I think maybe because they put it in the aluminum foil that makes it still hot. But it's still it's it's smoking. smoking. Y'all got me with the sauce already, though. Mm. Mm. Sauce good. We got jalapeno cornbread. Cornbread. Mm. Cornbread, too. Mm. This is good. This mm. is a good choice. Yep. So, if y'all checked out my other video, that's right up here that I uploaded earlier, 
about being happy. I say happy, but it's pretty much. Uh, <clears throat> hold on, I can't do it. <clears throat> I already knew. They huh? tried to get me gloves. I'm getting away. I think they gave me extra hot because I probably gave them a hard time. I said, how y'all can't accept credit cards over the phone? What? They was like, we didn't know how to do that. We are a new company. I was like, okay, let me walk y'all through the steps. Right. What the hell? And they accept my credit card over the phone. Oh, Anyway. Wow, wow for real? Yeah, I, I have to speak to the manager, and the manager sounded younger than the person that was just on the phone. So I was like, oh, God. That's crazy. This is spicy. And what did you get me? That was the last spice she had on. No, this is my lips are tingling right now. And I like hot stuff, but this is like a step above hot. Mm -hmm. um, oh, I'm I'm at peace. It's like when you get to that point, like I showed you on my pictures, it's going off the wall. When you get to that point where it's just like okay, they were so geek when you sleep like that. I gotta let go. Like I'm letting go. Like I was really holding hope, like you know what? Like six years. You you would think something would happen. A conversation, something. Ain't nothing happened. So I gotta move through this. Mm -hmm. And the only way for me to move through this is to let go. Let y'all see my hands. Like the go. physical stuff. The, the the stuff you can see. Yeah, the stuff that I can change. Yep. So I let that go. Cleaned out, released, moved everything, smudged my whole house. Don't feel, don't feel. Mm -hmm. I promise. Like it literally do feel lighter in here. I'm trying to tell you, I'm on a bigger and better thing. Here. Bigger and better thing. I'm gonna share with y'all before, um, before y'all leave. I'm gonna tell y'all what just happened yesterday. Why my truck wanna act the fool today? Ugh. But right. that's why I'm still good. I'm still yeah. good. I ain't got nowhere to go anyway. Okay, I'm trying to figure out what to eat next. It's spicy, y'all. No, it's fine. Yes, it is. No, oh, yes, it is. I think y'all figured it out. What? I'm not going to go to It wasn't even a little to me. Yeah, it's definitely uh, over my mm. nose, right on there. Oh. <laughs> oh. Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> you was trying to be gangster and just eat a lot of it at one time. Oh. See, I had to get a little water. Cool it down a little bit. Y'all. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Ooh, I should have got weak. I asked you, did you want weak? I should have got weak. Y'all got the same level? I'm weak as hell. <laughs> yep, hot. So, my anniversary day is April 21st. It's when I got proposed to on a boat in the middle of Bahamas. So, I'm going to do the throwback. Last time I mentioned anything about this on the channel. Oh, mm -hmm. that felt good to say that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why didn't I think of this before? That's because I was so sad. Everything happened for a reason. I don't know. Like I said earlier in my video, like I didn't, I didn't know what to expect. I just knew that I wanted to be healed and I wanted to be like, I wanted to be good. I didn't want to get a rebound relationship. Right. I didn't want to get a, just because in between knowing that my heart was still over here. Right. I just wanted to But I promise to you, Shell, I'm going to tell you something. Sometimes that's necessary. You might not want to do it and it might not be who you are, but I promise you, you might meet somebody who totally takes your mind. It, it, it's like a middleman. Well, no, no, you know how it, no, hold on, man, let me finish. You know how it's the big man who sailed away. Then you got the middleman who served it. Right. You buying the product, right? I'm tasting you need a middleman so you can get to your, get to the big man. So you ain't got to, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of like that. And you might just need that. There's nothing wrong with using somebody as a step stool to get over somebody else. I'm sorry I said it. <laughs> Babe, am I wrong? No. 
But you also don't want to block your blessings because you might find somebody who meant to be your somebody. And if that, no, don't get me wrong. That don't mean just going to it on some dog shit. I mean, like, if you know, if you if you get into it and you start talking to somebody, y'all vibing it, and you it just something like, look at it as them being a step stool to get over the past. Because then you they're gonna distract you, yes, but that don't mean you're gonna marry this motherfucker. See, you know what I'm saying? Nothing wrong with here's that. Here's my thing with that, right? Because you know I'm such an awesome person. Right. I don't wanna lead anybody <coughs> caught me. I don't wanna lead anybody on. Don't. Again I say, don't go into it with that mindset. You're not, oh, I'm not you going into it with that. Yeah, because that's just who you are naturally. Imagine what I'm saying is what I'm on. Right. I can hear the streets You don't have to you don't have to go into it with that mindset of okay, I know I'm not really I don't really want to fuck with this person. I'm just using them. But at that time, when you go into it, have fucking fun. Cut loose. It don't gotta be nothing serious. Use them. You're using them, but you're not using them. I get you get what I'm saying? Like you're you're like, okay, they're here to take my mind off that person. And then whenever my real boo come along, you know what I'm saying? I get what you're saying. That don't make you a bad person. People do that shit every day. It's called just living life and having fun. No Literally. Commitment. That's all that is. No commitment. You don't owe nobody nothing. I like the no commitments. That's what I'm going to live for the rest of my life. No, it's not. Did they oh, put sausage? Honey. Do you got sausage? I do. You want some? I don't have any. Oh no, we about to call. I'm about to call y'all back, little crowd. Yeah, where my sausage? I'm crying talking about where my sausage. Cause they definitely told me that um, they put them in there. No, yeah. look, I, I'm, um, I honestly don't feel like I'm ready for that. Not now. Not ready for what? What exactly aren't you ready for? Um, You're not ready to just hit it and quit it type shit? I, I'm not. See, like, I don't want to, I knew, like, when I started this eight months ago, I didn't want to be in a position where I'm just, you know, out here. Right, and nobody does, because I believe in soul ties and giving yourself to people and leaving some, a part of you with them. Yeah. So I'm not a hoe either. But you would think I was. No, I didn't say that. No, because of, you know, how you friendly I am. Hey. Right. I saw him too, girl. But I it's more no so of. Tinder, <laughs> not a profile on Tinder. You going crazy. But um, you don't have to like do people up to have fun with them and kick it. <laughs> not do people The hell? <laughs> yeah, you don't got to do people up. I don't believe in just doing up anybody. And I'm not. I'm freaky as hell when it comes to me, me because. I feel like she just super duper attractive and I'm a freak because I'm a Scorpio. You know? But like, when it comes to like, Nini, just being you? single, I'm not freaky. Nini, what are you? I'm not freaky when I'm single. I'm only freaky when I'm with somebody. If that makes sense. No, that's me too. You know? And I'm not just, you know, we got COVID and all this other mm -hmm. shit. I'm trying to be... Mm -mm. Won't give me the COVID, Coochie. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. <laughs> sure the fuck won't. No, I'm just in this place of healing. That's where I'm at. I know, like, I feel like, mm, I'll give myself another month. I'll be good. Start yeah. slow. Yeah. Get dressed up real nice and go to a bar and have a drink alone. Flirt. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Yeah, I'm, that's, what I'm, that's what I plan to do. That's, that's I tell you what, Shell, it's better than sitting in the motherfucking house crying and shit. Oh, Fuck I, that. I ain't crying yet. No, I mean, not crying. Oh, like, I did cry. You know, Let me stop playing. I did cry when it first happened, but then I was just like, you know what? Let me just focus on me, and I've been focusing on me. Right. And you know. I just one time I'm going to say it. The blessings of the Lord make it rich and add no sorrow to Literally. it. Literally. Have a blessed day. I'm not sad around these parts. You come me. What you want, baby? But yeah, y'all, I'm telling you, if you're going through the same thing like a breakup, start loving on yourself. Get back to what you like to do. Get back to That's what doing the video. things you want to accomplish. You know what I'm saying? Don't sit at home and just 
drown in your own sorrow. That shit is lame as hell. Not only is it lame, it's 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 a it's a self killer, a silent self killer. Yeah, y'all been watching me. I told y'all in my video I did earlier. Um, I wanted y'all to see because we don't see that. I said in my video earlier, like we see people when they're together, and then we don't see like what happened. After right, because they go go, especially then, YouTubers. Then we see. Here go a new relationship and we right. ain't, you ain't introduce them to nothing. Just hey, right. this is my new boo. Now y'all don't let right. go. Mm. I ain't on none of that. Ass team crash. And I'm about to be 41. <laughs> hey. I don't got no time. Yeah. I need somebody that's ready to go to the mountaintop and stay there. Girl, that's why I ain't getting no king, king crab. I don't like I don't like this. So I know I wasn't gonna like nothing poking me. Man, this shit. Uh, beat my ass. Uh, <laughs> I never knew you even wanted to eat this shit. Oh, you is not feeling this today. No, this is fire. It's just I don't like my hands. The process you want to de shell type shit. That's what I should have asked them if they had. It this is still you. hot, like still like, hot. This is fire I'm though. So get old fat. <laughs> But I want that. It's not coming out. What do you think, Mimi? About what? What's fire? Love, relationship. Love is soul dope. ties. I Love definitely believe in soul ties. And when it comes to soul ties, I think that it's a lot you can overcome and get through that many may not understand. But you will. Um, when it comes to love, I feel like it's a lot of things you can overcome, but there's more limits. So, you will know the difference between love and a soul tie. Like, and I just feel like no matter how many years you with a person, you can always get in a position where you feel like they was the one for you. Mm -hmm. And somebody else can come and be the one and give you the things that you never knew you needed or you never knew you wanted. Mm -hmm. You got to just be open, live life. Um, most importantly, know that it's okay to be happy. And you know what? Like not even jacking. I'm, I don't jack anyway. But this situation gave me the courage to... Uh, I'm gonna tell I'm gonna tell y'all at the end of the month wrap up, but I'm gonna tell y'all what what happened. But um it definitely gave me courage. It definitely um kicked my ass past fear. I'm beyond fear. Um what is that me? <laughs> oh, you said it wasn't hot. <laughs> it's hot. I ate that corn girl. Her sausage was just Absorbed yes. up in the corn. Y'all, they didn't give me no sauces. I'm all the shell bowls. Oh, my hello. Uh, yeah, right there. Mimi was definitely adamant about it not being hot. Yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> on fire. Watch the difference. Oh, this is mine, not mine? Yeah. I ate it. Oh, yeah, my corn wasn't. It was hot, but not that hot. You acting like your ears about to pop off. Dang. That's because it's stuck. She, she, the, the shrimp then had a juice on there. Yeah, you gotta mm -hmm. bite it and then now stick it up in there flat where that piece at where you're gonna bite it in. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -mm. Ooh. I'm used to it now. I'm not. I'm still tingling over here. <clears throat> mm. Love is beautiful. You know what I was going to say yes, the other day and the, and the cousin when we was talking about where we was talking about people don't uh, understand love. Mm -hmm. um, we come into relationships with our own traumas, issues, things like that, right? Mm -hmm. And we don't take the time to like be honest with that. Mm -hmm. So then we get in a relationship yes. and expect that other person to just be Take our, it away. our savior, our yep. rainbow, our bridge, our yep. uh and then when they don't fulfill the thing that we are looking for, and half the times we don't even tell the people that that's what we're looking for. We just assume that they're supposed to know. Yeah. 
Me and but, they had that issue. We did. But that's where we got through it. Though. We're communicating and comprehending and understanding like, hey, this is who I am. Um, compromise is something I hear people say all the time, but people don't really understand what that word means. They don't. They just think like, oh, if you want McDonald's and I want Burger King, you should just... Yeah, but that's no. not really that. It's like really finding a common ground where y'all can say, you know what, I understand you, you understand me. Together, let's do this. Yep. And for me, that's where I feel like I'm in a place where um, I have so many things going on right now. And... Um, the once was, was supportive and encouraging. And right now it's just like, I needed this time for me. I needed this time to get back to that hungry, that ambitious, that I'm the shit when it comes to what I do. I'm the shit when it comes to what I do. Message. Mm -hmm. And I'm not going to back down from any of that. And I needed that. And I saw that yesterday with the situation that happened. And I was just like, oh, shit, I'm back. That's why I know the streets is calling me. Because... <laughs> <laughs> you want another one, baby? Give me a shirt. Because my nails are just... That's how I know. But no, it's, I just feel like people don't have... They don't have that thing where it's like, you know what? I really want to be with you. We like, okay, we survived a global... That's y'all cute. Fucking pandemic. Mm -hmm. But, uh, so I need to be comfortable where it's like, fuck comfort right now. Like you should be living your best life. Like, let's talk about these people that's out here getting this PPP money, right? Right. You I'm getting crazy. the PPP money, but you ain't doing shit with it. The right things with it. I'm sorry. I'm just I just wanted to say that because a lot of y'all got it, but y'all ain't doing what you should be doing with it. So when you get that knock on your door, hey, but even that, it's like, if you were with somebody and y'all really building, build. <laughs> like yeah. build. Don't don't pretend build. Like actually build. Like right. we survived a global fucking pandemic. People look at this shit as white. But it's like yeah. why, why would I want to be mediocre when I have nothing but space and opportunity to be great? Exactly. So let me ask a question. This is just a in general question. Have you ever thought people sometimes think that like they know deep down inside they're not good enough for you or they will never amount to what you deserve or what you're looking for? So sometimes they walk away to be with somebody who's equal level to them so that way they don't feel like a lower person. Hey, our conversation in our bed, <laughs> girl, be so lit. Sometimes like, you got to get on a different that. level to somebody who on a level as you so I you can feel you. bigger or something because like that. they will feel intimidated yeah. and not even tell Sometimes you. you can be too strong of a woman and they don't want you to know that. So they have to find a replacement. That happens a lot in straight couples, them. though. That happens a lot in straight couples. That. It happens to gay couples, too, but it yeah, happens a lot in straight couples. Mine. Boom. I didn't even think about it. I didn't even think or consider that. Yeah. Because sometimes when we go through like breakups and stuff like that, the number we one question. We didn't ask ourselves all the questions the, in the world. No, but the number one. one question, the first thing we do is we Why? blame ourselves. Why? Oh, what I did I do that. wrong? I did Where did I go wrong? You blame yourself. Maybe I did it too right. When in reality, sometimes you did something right. You made this come to light, what was hidden. And all, it's just so many ways and perspectives things could be looked at, mm -hmm. and you will never know. Unless a person is bold enough to tell you. Let me try this cornbread, y'all. Oh, we didn't even try All right, or the biscuits. Or the or biscuits. Beignets. We got you with yeah. I want to try it all. I want to try the cornbread. I'm going to try the beignets. I ain't eating mm. like this. This is good. Mmm. Mmm. That is really good. What the hell? Mmm. Mmm. Oh, look at this. That's like flavor. 
Mm, very fine fuck. Mm. Is it something in the cereal? It's like every time you chew. Mm-mm. No? Mm. Mm. First you get buttery. Then you get like sweet. Mm. Then you get a little heat. This like this would be a good 420 uh <laughs> it's like a little donut. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it's real soft and mm -hmm. I'm a piece of cornbread. Oh that cornbread is fire. Mm. Oh it's like it's like grandma mm -hmm. cornbread. Like this is like mm -hmm. grandma. With little bitty pieces of mm -hmm. jalapeno throughout it. It's mm -hmm. really good. This is good. It's like a donut. Mm -hmm. That mm -hmm. sugar on the outside you trick it to be. Mm -hmm. <laughs> They got milk thinking. Damn, I didn't even Oh, I can get some deeper some thoughts with some conversation. Oh, we finna turn up. We finna do these videos. Oh, and we liquor. And we got some L. Oh, we'll be a thought thought. Yeah, we got some. You already know. It's 420. We finna turn up. Man, she ain't ready. You already right. know. Oh, she I get ready. down with the talk. Yeah. Shell. No, I'm a communicator, so I, this is my Oh, yeah, yeah, this of my, course. This right here. That's what I was saying with the video and stuff, and I was talking about the women empowerment and stuff, because it'd be like, baby, show me stuff. She'd be like, look, babe, this is so you. Y'all just like, like all that. Shell, I'm, Listen, know, I can, I can I'm a whole well, fan. Well, I'm a whole fan. how you know. It's, I'm it's telling you, good. it's good. It's bark. Cause if y'all never pick another. What the hell is this? Low craft county, low crown, whatever it low is. Low county, low country. Get y'all some beignets. These are fire. Mm. They are. Mm. Mm. They are fire. Mm. I'm right where I need to be to drink. Wait, so she? You said you was a fan. I need to hear this. Like I'm a whole fan. Like I what? Like I binge watch you. On days I ain't got no editing, Yo, you, Natalie and uh, mm -hmm. Natalie and Easy, um, Quan Tran, Sam's World. Oh, I, like I sit and binge watch y'all. Got my water, baby. Got my water, baby. Oh, I said I was gonna do. Sam's I'm supposed to collab for you. I wanna do her. Uh, I got my water, baby. I wanna do that. Yeah. 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 She do her. I'm just being watching you shit. I'm a whole fan. You didn't even know. No, but that's why I started doing this because I was like, you know what? We don't even see that. Like, I think more people need to see, like, real life stuff. Like, mm -hmm. you break up with somebody, of course you're going to fucking be heartbroken. I'm heartbroken. Well, I'm not heartbroken anymore. I was heartbroken. But I'm at the space now where it's like in the middle where it's like, you know, I'm. I'm over, I'm getting over it. Mm -hmm. It'll all be solidified on May the 6th at 11 a.m. But um, I'll be, I feel better. Like, I don't feel sad. I don't feel like. And you know what I like about you? You're not like one of them people who, like, I can talk to you about your shit. Because you're not annoying <laughs> with it. You ever talk to somebody who got dumped or went through some shit and it's just like, would you shut the hell up? I don't feel that way when you talk because it's so relatable. Maybe because like we already got like a vibe, you know? But it's people, you hear they shit, you be like, girl, I don't, I don't care. I don't want to talk about that no more. I'm not even trying to be mean. But like it's Michelle, talk about it. yeah, it's like she make it sound so interesting. <laughs> I know it's like your pain, but it's it so interesting. Like, yeah, it's like, like felt feel like you can feel it. Yeah. Like, uh, so you know it and then I like chill, so I'm more happy. So I know when I release this music, you know. You know I need surprise. that surprise. I need that like a little. Oh yeah, I said the other day I was getting ready to work out. I was like, oh, I can't play this for y'all because I'm giving it some up. So I got you. I got I you. I just yes. need a little tweak. Oh, her voice. <laughs> <laughs> I got a little auto. Yeah, little auto. Little auto. Little caller, little auto. I got you. Caller, little auto. I'm sitting up looking they like this. They know they just gave me some more shrimp. Oh, I had plenty. Mm -hmm. I still got a couple of them. Why am I doing this? I got myself. One, two. I got one, mm -hmm. two. Uh, uh, two. Two. 